violence unfolded overnight on social media. CBS 2's Chris Ty is live in Kenosha piecing together dozens of eyewitness videos. Chris. Brad Erica stitched together those dozens of online videos and a narrative begins to emerge. Not only was Rittenhouse not arrested last night, at the beginning of the evening, authorities thanked he and his so-called citizens brigade that showed up here in Kenosha. And at the end of the night, he was able to walk right out of the Kenosha hot zone. We appreciate you guys, we really do. Before there were bullets in the air, in this pocket of Kenosha at least, there were attaboys for the so-called citizens brigade. With that, the crew, some armed with long guns, took on the night. We don't have non-lethal. So you guys are full on ready to defend the property? Yes, we are. They don't have badges, but seem to have tacit approval from the same sheriff's officials telling others. You are a civilian. This area is closed to them. You are trespassing. Leave. Leave now. 17-year-old Kyle Rittenhouse, part of the brigade last night, wore a white hat, green shirt, blue gloves, carrying with him a long gun and, it appears, permission. Listen to what appears to be a hasty confession. As witnesses try and keep him alive, right his head in his head. Kyle starts down the street and is noticed. He's taken to the ground, then fires his weapon at attackers. Another person appears shot by his long gun. This time, police attend to the injured. Kyle keeps walking inching toward authorities at the end of the block as onlookers flag him to police. Hey, he just shot them! Hey, do it right here, just shot them! Do it right here, just shot all of them down there! With blue-gloved hands in the air, the gun around his chest, the brigade member thanked at the start of the night is given safe passage past police. Not stopped and cuffed, but allowed to exit with only this warning. The mayor of Kenosha making it very clear they do not want any citizens to show up as sort of some sort of police effort, armed or otherwise. That is a clear message to stay away from Kenosha. And from the sheriff in Kenosha County today, two points. He said, number one, the fact that we gave water to that group should not imply that we were giving them tacit permission. We've given water to a lot of different groups. And two, if there was any indication that Rittenhouse with his hands up there was trying to turn himself in, he says his deputies didn't realize it. In Kenosha, Chris Ty, CBS 2 News.